position those piles for us on the haul road. Now we're going to bring them in and show you what this 45 cubic yard U blade looks like in action, okay? Coming in, this machine weighs in at 230,000 pounds, has an assert engine under the hood capable of producing 450, uh, sorry, 850 horsepower. Now he's going to make two short pushes for you so you can see exactly what 45 cubic yards looks like. Now as he backs up here, we have two other style blades for these large tractors. We have a 58 yard U-blade or a carry dozer blade. We also have a 98 yard coal blade. So as he backs up here, he's doing a little slot dozing technique for you. He's made his first initial pass. He's backed up just a little bit, about half the length of the tractor. He's going to make another push, taking it down, get a good blade load. Now he's going to take that load and he's going to hoist it up to the ceiling for you. And what he's going to show you, he's not going to show you that he can load a, load a truck, but what he's going to show you is the perfect balance of these large track type tractors. Configuring the right blade and the right ripper or counterweight assembly. Here we go, we're going to balance up on top of the pile. Nice job. You guys notice anything wrong? What's wrong with this machine? There is no operator. If you look out here in front, where'd he go? Oh, here he comes. This is Scott Thomas, one of our professional demonstrator instructors. He's been running that machine remote control. It is one of the new safety options for our large tractors. It is called Cat Command for Dozing. So you see he has all the control functions, switches, everything on that pack on his waist. He controls the direction, he controls the blade, he can control the gear shift, pitch of the blade forwards and backwards. Nice job, ST. That was a good balance act, pal. <laughs> now, a lot of people ask, why do we have this remote control feature or option? These machines, in the different environments that they work in, sometimes the operator and machine are put in very unsafe conditions. Sometimes they're working over the top of a leach pad where there is a lot of acid out there. There's acid pump.